Hello friends, it's Saturday and welcome to part one of my Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy playthrough. I'm going to be doing the games in order from one to three and eventually four when I get the game. I'm just going to keep quiet because it's a cutscene. Okay, here we go. Um, hopefully you can hear me okay. I mean, I'm eventually going to check the video anyway later, so I'll know. But I do got to stay quiet today. But that's okay. Let's, let's begin. I'm going to collect as many Wumpa Fruit and Lives as I possibly can because I just want to have a higher likelihood of not dying. Okay, I know to play the game, don't worry. This is definitely a very difficult game. I've played this game before. Uh, I've never played the original, but I did play uh, The Wrath of Cortex on the PS2 years ago. It was my only true Crash Bandicoot experience. Um, but I did play the Insane Trilogy, I think a few years back, like 2021 or something like that. The only thing was, was um, uh, I didn't play too much of it, but I have some experience. So I'm not going in blind. But when I get into the second and third game, it will definitely be blind. Like, I pretty much know nothing about those games. And I've never played the third one. I think I played the second one for even a few minutes at best. But I've basically no experience at all with um, the second or third game. But the first game, I've played a little bit. But this is um, a game that starts off not too hard. You think you're very confident you'll be fine, but... I know how hard this game gets. I'm invincible. Yep. As soon as I get invincibility, my ch my likelihood of dying multiplies by 10. You know, it just happens. Oh, I don't mind that this game's 30 FPS because it's not one of those games where you're moving very fast. Like, this is a game I don't mind being 30. If there was 60 FPS as an option, I wouldn't mind that. I'm just going to check and see if... Okay, don't think there is. That's fine. But if it was, like, a really, really fast-paced game, where you're doing a lot of movement very quickly, 30 FPS would be horrible. And thankfully, there's basically no motion blur in this game, because Ratchet & Clank 2016 on the PS4 has motion blur and 30 FPS, so it's just unplayable. It's, it's horrible. But on PS5, it looks great. Oh uh, yeah. Not gonna get all these boxes, but I'll try and get what I can. I mean, I don't usually try to get all the boxes, but I do know you obviously get a reward for collecting them all. One thing I'll probably do is off camera or not recording videos, I'll do some cleanup because this is just gonna be a playthrough. I'm not trying to 100% the game. I'm just going from the start to the end. This is basically an any percent playthrough. That is my only goal. And then off camera or not recording, I'll be basically um, doing some cleanup or doing collectibles or whatever. Well, I'm not trying to speedrun, but I definitely don't want to be sitting around for too long, just spending ages on a level. The only time I feel like that will happen is unintentionally when I'm on a level that's very hard. Um, I swear I jumped on that skunk, but I guess its tail doesn't have a hitbox. That's fine. Collect as much wumpa as I can. Thank you. <laughs> Look at these morons. <laughs> They're so stupid. I don't know if the microphone picked that up, but there are some very fast and loud cars driving outside. I'm interested. <laughs> oh, there's a, a Tana token. I think that's what they're called. Tana coins? I don't know. Okay. Yeah, you move faster too with this. And apparently break box is easier too. That's helpful. And you can just walk through them, nice. I also want to do a Super Monkey Ball Banana Mania playthrough because Banana Mania is 
pretty much a remaster of my favourite Monkey Ball, which is Super Monkey Ball Deluxe. Like, it's so great that I can now play it on the Xbox Series X because I, I can record pretty easily and uh, the game just looks fantastic. But to be fair, I think I still prefer Deluxe. I always, pretty much at any time I see a box, I absolutely always try to jump on them. Because if I spin, it will knock everything away. And if I get, you know, one of these coins for the special level, I may miss it. And, you know, that's not good. Or I may even miss out on like, getting extra life. So, yeah, I don't want that. Bye-bye. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <laughs> I'm still here collecting. Alright, that was fine. Don't want to get too cocky though, because I know how hard this game gets. I've been there, believe me. And that's the thing as well. I wanted to just start a new save on a like a, another save file, but apparently I just wasn't given the option to make a new save file. It was oh, continue or make a new game. You can't do anything else. I'm like, I just want to start a new save just for my playthrough, but I guess not. These turtle guys are funny, but like, it's funny how even if you touch them, touch them, you're dead. It's so weird. Oh, these guys are a pain in the hole. Monkeys, monkeys with massive testicles. I may or may not insert the clip of where I referenced that from. I probably will. But I don't know. Ooh. <laughs> oh my god. He just shrinks into nothing. Alright. Here we go, all the Aku Akus, and let's breeze. Let's eat herself away. Well, no, that, that sounds like someone with a, who's overweight with an eating disorder eating themselves away. That's actually kind of sad. I, don't, I didn't mean for that to turn a negative, but whatever. <laughs> that was not my intentions, I swear. While I try my best to uh, reference the fact that it could have even sounded that way. Yeah, sure, okay. Here's the second bonus level, I think. My memory is terrible, I don't even know. Yeah, I want to get every single box. No! Alright, let's go, 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 go. Come on, Crash. It's so great that you can use the D-pad on these 2D sections, because it makes everything so much easier. Oh my god. Because if I couldn't... These levels would be so much harder. I'd be constantly moving forward and back when I don't need to. Yeah, this is uh, the end of part one. I'm not planning to make the episodes too long. Only around 10 minutes or less. Uh, hope you enjoyed watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you later.